Uh, let's see, leather, armor, don't need it. Get rid of the dirty waters. Probably. I guess while I'm sitting here selling stuff, I could uh, discuss another comment I got. Uh, Mamakai1987 was wondering why I don't use the skill books. I've said it before, but uh, it's been a while, so I'll say it again. I don't use the skill books because I want to make sure I can use up all my skill points through leveling up first. Because if you reach a point where all of your skills are maxed out and you're at a level up screen and you need to use your skill points and you can't, your game just stays there. You can't progress. You can't finish the leveling up process. You're just stuck. I've been there before, so I've had to reload a previous save and then use a cheat to take away you know, the 23 skill points from a skill or something just to use when the level up came again just so I could get past and continue on with the game, so uh, I don't want to have to go through that all that process again, so I really just want to uh, wait until I pretty much finish leveling up or within a few levels of the maximum level 30 or whatever uh, so I know how much how many points I have left and then then I can use the books if I have any points left that I need to fill up after I'm done leveling. I can use the books to finish that off. Um, and it all depends on your leveling up. I mean, if you're doing what I'm doing and getting, you know, intelligence up to 10 as soon as possible and getting the uh, education or the educated perk, whatever it is, that gives you three more skill points, so you're getting 23 skill points per level and you have the... Um, uh, DLC Broken Steel so you get a level 30 cap and then you're going to you're gonna get plenty of skill points and you're going to run into the possibility that you might max out your skills with just the skill points or get really close so you may not need the skill books um, and then you also have to count in like um, the bobbleheads each of the skill bobbleheads gives uh, gives 10 points each of the skill bobbleheads gives 10 points per oh come on game quit lagging thanks see gives you later each of the bobbleheads for skills gives 10 points per skill so you've got to count those in there's some perks like um well, the silent running perk that gives 10 points to to uh, sneaking. Well, you gotta, aren't you looking fine? You gotta count those in. That's the lady we rescued from Dukov. Um, One of the new immigrants died of radiation poisoning last week. Yeah, I heard she was drinking river water. Don't know you. Don't care. Keep it. Sh um. Know where I can offload some guns? You're kidding, right? Flak and shrapnel's in the market. I'm a shrapnel, you idiot. Well, then let me s let me buy stuff then. What you looking for? Don't call me an idiot if you won't sell me anything. Definitely taking that. So, anyways, as I was saying earlier, um, you know, and if you don't level up like I have, if you've leveled up other things besides intelligence or you haven't focused on getting you know the maximum amount of skill points whatever then the skill books are gonna come in a lot more useful to you you're gonna you're gonna make more use out of getting those extra skill points that you're not getting through regular level ups and stuff but it's just a matter of how you've built your character and I've built mine to maximize getting skill points just through leveling up so the skill books aren't quite as useful That's not to say they won't be useful um, at some point. They're just not 
going to be as useful as another character that's lacking in in that department in terms of leveling up, so there you go. That's why I'm saving the skill books and not using them at this point. <laughs> 49 frag mines. Great. I'm gonna have to find one of the merchants again. One of the caravanners. Uh... Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. Another satisfied customer. The ship's water isn't much better. If we don't get fresh water soon, there was we'll some all sort end of battle in the city yesterday. The gate guards at the gunfire went on the roll right now. Well, I hope we do something. Remember that child that fell off the deck last year? Yeah, that was bad. That Anyways, was let's go. Let's go back to Megaton, and um, I guess I'll go have to sell stuff to the companions. Or not the companions. Why do I switch words around like that? I'm a retard. To the caravan people. Outside of Megaton. Because I need to get rid of some of that other stuff. I can probably buy some combat armors from... That one caravan dude, Crow, I think his name is. Help repair our stuff that we have. Speaking of which, we should repair while I'm thinking about it. Helped a little bit, but we, we could still use some more. Where's Sydney's gun? Sydney's gun, there it is. Oh, it's fully repaired anyway, never mind. Energy weapons, by the way, if you don't use them a lot, they sell for pretty good money, so... That's just something to keep in mind. If you stick with small guns, you can sell the, uh, like, laser pistols and laser rifles, especially laser rifles, uh, for a decent amount of money. rested bonus and then we'll go give the scrap metal we have to Walter for a nice little boost in experience, free experience for the win and karma because we'll get karma because we're just going to give it to him not sell it to him and uh, we'll go sell to the merchants and I think that'll be it for this set of videos because my game is lagging like crazy and that usually means if that happens this late it means that uh, I've made a long enough set of videos so <laughs> good for now besides if it's gonna lag like this it's nearly unplayable anyway so might as well be done, get the videos rendered out and uploaded for you guys. Play later sometime. What do you need? 
scrap metal. I sh Take all the scrap metal I have, no charge. Are you serious? Why? I Hope you're happy. Bye now. By the way, I forgot to show you guys, but this is the wig. How awesome is that, huh? Now well, we're styling. Just in case you were wondering. And yes, it does go through coats like the Sheriff's Duster. <laughs> For whatever reason. It is a very handy item to have that wig because it helps with bartering and speech. So basically, I, I try to remember to wear it anytime I'm in town simply because it's just that handy. I mean, whether you're buying stuff or talking to somebody, it's going to help, so... Merchants, show up. Oh, look, it's the doctor. How wonderful. Hey there. Looking for your fix? Not really. I'm just here to sell stuff. Tell me what you need, and maybe I've got your fix. You've got nothing. If I didn't have, like, a hundreds of... Stim packs, he might be useful, but I'm just here for your monies. That's really all I am here for, is your monies. Like that. I'm hoping you can have all these, but I don't know. Nope. Maybe you can take all the mines and I'll take my other guns back. Okay, so there's doo -doo 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 -doo. Uh, just under a hundred caps. So um, you can have that one, and that'll work. I don't care if you got a little extra money off the deal. Another satisfied customer. Gotta go. Cheers, Pat. At least you took all my mines for me. All those wonderfully useless mines. Wolfgang. Looking to trade? Crazy Wolfgang's got just what you need. Assuming you need the random junk that I've got. Nope, not really, but, um... Yeah. That... Thirty frag grenades. You can have... Twenty of those, anyway. That. Um. 